finished uh, getting lunch with my friend. For today is filming a self tape. It's not guaranteed I'm gonna be seen. Okay, you guys, just got out of the audition. I it's Sunday morning. I just finished a little workout. Um, and now I'm gonna make breakfast. I'm gonna do cottage cheese with berries and a banana. Got the cottage cheese. Shout out to my friend Julia, who got me obsessed with cottage cheese. Um, I used to always kind of think it was weird, but now I'm like, it's so good. The berries. Berries are so good for you. And I try to incorporate them into my diet as much as I can. Ooh, we have a little stem. Um, really good anti-inflammatory, antioxidants, all that good stuff. Let me get a little banana. Usually I do scrambled eggs with cottage cheese mixed in, but um, my bananas are like all at their perfect time. So I figured I would incorporate the bananas into my breakfast today. There we go. There's breakfast. I'm just getting ready for the day. And <laughs> I'm about to do a like Zoom meeting for a job I found on Indeed. And I'm 98% sure that it's a scam. Um, but I need a job. And I'm literally trying everything. Like, I'm not cutting myself off from any potential opportunity. So, yeah. That's going to be interesting. I'll let you know if it was a scam or not. Um, yeah. <laughs> it's like, it's for a remote travel agent job. Um, so I applied and then they were like, come to this Zoom meeting. Which, that to me seems weird. So we'll see. Joined that meeting for two minutes and left. It was a scam. Not really a scam, but like, it's similar to real estate where they were like, oh, you get your travel agent certification and then you do this. But the posting on Indeed was so misleading because it looked like it was an application to be a remote travel agent and that they would be training you on the job fake news and it's not like salary it's like oh if you can find people like no i'm not i've i have a million businesses i'm not doing that okay so now i'm picking out my outfit for the day it's gonna be a gorgeous day in new york and i'm gonna go meet my friend for lunch so i'm picking out a cute little outfit and then um i think i'm just gonna kind of enjoy the city and walk around today so that's the fun little plan okay now i am working on learning two combinations from videos one is to submit a video self tape and then another is for the in-person audition for broadway shows mostly now they've been including a video of the dance audition before you go so that they can kind of breeze through teaching it in the room so you need to kind of learn it beforehand so that's what I'm doing now okay I'm getting ready to head out to go meet my friend for lunch um, and I'm going like lower midtown ish I'm going to nomad which is an area of the, uh manhattan um and i heard on a podcast to always bring a book with you everywhere you go if you're really trying to consistently read so this is my subway book packing her in my little bag so i can read on the way instead of scrolling on my phone <laughs> Okay, 
I just I just finished uh, getting lunch with my friend. We talked for so long. It's 4.15 and I decided I'm gonna walk all the way home from the Flatiron District up to the Upper East Side home um, and just enjoy the views. I've walked nearly four miles and I'm still not home. <laughs> but I feel good. It feels good to walk around the city and not have to use the subway. Look at the nice trash behind me. Oh, New York. Um, yeah, but it was a really nice little walk. I've been walking for 85 minutes. Yeah. Okay, we're back home. I am thawing out some shrimp very aggressively for dinner. Um, let's just let those sit for a sec. Um, and I listened to a podcast on my very long walk. Um, and the person was interviewing a woman who owns a wine company. And it made me need wine. I needed it. Can you see my purple teeth already? Um, I had a glass. I'm gonna have another while I cook. I'm gonna make some lentil pasta and then I'm gonna do my shrimp in like a butter, garlic, uh, red pepper. Crit, what's the word? Like I'm gonna saute it. We throw in some broccoli and drizzle it with olive oil and do some seasonings. So like a buttery, seasony sauce. Um, so yeah, I'm just watching some TV, drinking my wine, thawing my shrimp, making dinner. It's empty. <laughs> and watching the Today Show. Okay, so on the docket for today is filming a self-tape. Here's the fit. Um, it's for a Broadway tour. And I can't really see. Okay. Here's the fit. It's for a Broadway tour. Um... The combo is like a bit athletic, so wanted to give athletic vibes. Um, and yeah, so I'm gonna go do that at the studio that I teach at. They're letting me use the space. So we'll see how filming my first tape there goes. Um, so I'm gonna like organize all my shit. And then right after that, I'm gonna head to Steps to take class. Okay, got the little phone stand and the thingy mabob that screws into it and then I'm just gonna pack my bag. I don't wanna lug my computer around all day, so I'm transferring all of the files of like the dance combo and the music to my iPad over there. She's charging up um, to make sure I have everything while I'm filming. I can like refer back to the instructional video and um, just carry my iPad for the day and not my whole computer. Thank God for AirDrop. There we go. Done. She's over there now. Okay, I'm in the studio. It feels so nice to just like have a space to film. So I'm gonna get set up. I'm like trying to figure out where to put the camera. There's a mirror there and there's a mirror there. So either way, I'm gonna be looking in the mirror and have a mirror behind me, but I need to like get a good height for my camera to be at to dance. <laughs> this combo. It's hard. 
There's lots of jumps and athletic stuff. I'm dead. I'm so sore. I've just been sitting on the couch chugging water. And now I'm working on submitting my self tape that I took this morning. So what you have to do for that really depends on the audition, but lately it's been kind of the same. So generally you make like a Google Drive folder and you make a folder. Here's like an example of one I did for Mean Girls. You do like, folder you click on it and you share that folder with the casting team and then you have like your slate and your songs your resume your headshot dance combo all of that and then you like send that folder to the casting team so now i'm gonna make whoop, i'm gonna make a new folder for this audition and upload everything and send it in Just made a delicious dinner we got some salmon with seasoning on it a potato and broccoli a nice hearty dinner after a big day of dancing okay just showered I'm in the fit for the audition so cute um you might be able to guess what show I'm auditioning for by this fit drop below what you think it is um yeah but there's the fit I always wear my full outfit to the audition because you just don't know if when you get there they're gonna be like oh we have a spot for somebody to go in this group right now and you have to be ready so I have to wear this uncomfortable ugh, fishnets and these arms for who knows how long. I'm just doing a full beat for this audition right now and it's so funny because they're, it's not guaranteed I'm gonna be seen. I actually have no clue if they're gonna see us. I hope, obviously, I don't wanna be doing all of this for nothing and I love this choreography and I want to be able to do it. I've never gone in for this Broadway show before and it's been running for a long time. So I just want to get my face in there because it is a dream for sure. My last time. Okay, here's the final look. Um, I'm like running kind of late so I have no idea what number I'm about to be on the non-equity list but I need to get my clothes on pack a lunch and make sure everything is in my bag and then I'm gonna go hello everybody I'm here with the Julia Feely I may have seen her on the TikTok I think she likes his baby <laughs> I'm gonna insert a clip here um, but yeah, we're at this audition and um, we're just, you know, we're just, just telling what's going on, but we're just chit-chatting, having a good time, and that's really all we have to say for now, so we'll keep you in the loop later. Bye! <laughs> Hey you guys, just got out of the audition. I did get seen, so that early morning full face and makeup was well worth it. Um, and so it ended up that they said that females were supposed to be later in the day and that men were early, but a different, the playbill listing said it was gonna be all the genders together. Um, so then all of the girls, because there weren't that many men, there's never as many men as there are women. So all of the girls um, signed up on the men's list. Yeah. So um, we like technically went during the men's time, but it was a big group of girls and like two guys. And 
this is for a Broadway show, and I got past the cut, which is awesome. So what they do is you do a combo, and then they um, call out names for people to stay to keep dancing, um, which means they're interested in you. So I got past the cut, and then they were like, okay, um, that's all we need today from all of us who are left. Um, my friend Julia made the cut too. Love her. And yeah, it was just a good experience. It's cool to, you know, be in a Broadway audition and doing well. Um, so hopefully one day, if the track opens up that I'm right for in the show, I will be invited to a future callback or something. So keep your fingers crossed for me. It's literally one of my dream shows. And I just feel really good that I got past the cuts. Yeah, good day. Now I'm gonna head home and try to do laundry and do normal people things. Hey! Hey. You, you've been on the vlog, right? Once or twice. Okay, this is Tyler. You may have seen Tyler on the vlog. We went to college together. We're good little friends. <laughs> and we just had some drinky poos and talked the talk and we're walking the walk. Yeah, we had the talk. <laughs> there are lots of talks to have. You guys can guess what talk we had below. Um, yeah, but it was a great time. We're walking back to my apartment. Tyler is gonna tinkle. And then we're gonna call it a night. We're gonna sleep over. <laughs> what would you rate your time with me tonight from a scale of one to 10? A solid eight and a half. <laughs> That's like, probably the best rating I've ever gotten so mm -hmm. thank you for that I just taught my morning ballet class it was a very fun feels so good to like be in ballet and I got paid to teach it which is cool um, so now I'm packing to go to New Jersey for just like two or three days to help out with my niece um, so that's the end of my New York week yay I hope you guys enjoyed this video and um, give you a little insight of like what a Broadway audition looks like, what being a an actor auditioning in New York City is like. It was a good week and um, I'm excited to just like keep putting the work in. I'll keep you guys all updated on everything. Okay, see you next time. Bye.